Welcome back. The Mariners open up a pivotal homestand tonight. They play three games against their division rivals, the Los Angeles Angels, and then three games against one of the best teams in baseball, the LA Dodgers. All of this comes amid a very tight postseason race. Mariners president of business operations, Katie Griggs, is here to talk baseball with me. And you brought a special guest, which I feel like we right off the bat need to talk I about. I brought the <gasps> special guest. Yes. No, I think one of the things that's so fun about this year's team is the fact there's so much character and personality in our Absolutely. clubhouse. Absolutely. And watching the guys celebrate. I mean, this is the Trident. As you can feel, the thing's not light. I was going to say, this is, you know, way heavier than I think. But we were talking earlier that obviously they're athletes. They make it look really easy. I will assure you this is very, very intense. And to walk me through the significance of this. When do people get to have the Trident? Well, the Trident really is just a key moment of our home run celebrations. And thankfully, we have a lot of guys who've been hitting a lot of home runs this year. So you've gotten to see a fair bit of the Trident. But ultimately, it's about bringing the guys together, having that moment of celebration, and then getting right back out there to win some games. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I'm going to put this down <laughs> because I do not want beads of sweat dripping down already. Okay, so what is happening with this homestead tonight, uh, this week? It's starting off. We have a ton of fun things happening. We're really excited. It's our week of Los Angeles, apparently. apparently. So Angels are in town tonight, and it's one of the things I love best is really we've got this opportunity to make baseball a game that's accessible to everyone. So with our new 640 start times, the shorter game times this year, it's really kind of cool. You can get there, watch an entire baseball game, and still get out of there by around 9 o'clock. So even as a mother of young children, it's something where as these games are important, as we're getting towards the end of the season, I have the opportunity to bring my kids with me. We also have six more value games. We've got tickets for $10, $20, and even $30 in prime locations around the ballpark. So our players feed off the energy of our fans, and we're looking forward to seeing them out there. Absolutely. And are there still tickets left? Because I feel like there's a lot of hype right now as we go into the last there's few weeks. There's a lot of excitement. Tickets yes. have been going really, really fast. We're running pretty low for this weekend, but there's still a handful out there, particularly Friday. And I'm super excited. We're going to have 400 drones out there for a drone show. We did one last oh my year gosh. when we announced the All-Star Game. It's incredible. It's a lot of fun. If you haven't seen it, it's a great opportunity to get to see something new and different. So Friday night, we'll get to celebrate with the drones. And then again, Got some games today, tomorrow, and then a fun day game on Wednesday as well. I love it. And is there bark in the park as bark well? Bark in the park tonight. Oh, my god! Simba Cam is possibly my, my favorite. So. That might be a highlight. Okay, so talk to me, too, about the postseason chase. What can people look forward to? Every game matters. Every game matters all season, but this is the time where you really start to feel it. And we've got some really exciting games. As you mentioned, the Angels coming in town, the Dodgers, but then that next homestand, got the Houston Astros and the Texas Rangers. These are the games that are really going to determine, do we get into the postseason? And if we do, are we wild card? Can we go for the division? Where do we land? And so every single one of these games, we need our fans to show out and support these guys. They feed off the energy. We're in the thick of it, and it's going to be a really exciting final few weeks of the season. I know, absolutely, and that's what you're saying. So players have been expressing that they really feel the energy from the from the crowd, and so selling out these games, I mean, how important is that as we, you know, round out the season? It's huge. I think whenever you look at our players, they talk about it after the games. It's just the energy, the excitement of our fans, feeling the fans supporting them, feeling the fans lift them up when things aren't going the way that they want, and then really pushing over the edge and really getting some of the blowout baseball that we all really enjoy at the times when things are going great. It's a lot of fun. It's fun for the fans, but it really is something where the players talk about it. They talk about it to each other. They talked about it in this offseason going into this season with a lot of our new guys, and they've gotten to experience it. That is so amazing. I love this team so much, and I'm here's to hoping I guess we see a lot of the Trident tonight as well. Thank you so much for being here, Katie. Absolutely amazing to have you on the show. Thanks for having me.